Many people would not think of our planet as a living, breathing organism, and rarely see it as anything other than a solid, unchangeable object. But beneath the Earth's skin lies a beating heart and a flowing, fluid system that affects us all. And we are changing this system. We are changing our world. With a constantly growing global population and an ever-increasing need for energy comes an increasing quantity of waste. Lots of waste. Throughout human history, our solution has been to simply bury that waste. But as our technologies have become more and more sophisticated, the pollutants that we put into the ground have become more and more toxic. Some, such as nuclear waste, do not degrade for millions of years and is a serious risk to our lives and future well-being. This is because everything in our globe is connected from the soil in the ground to the water we drink and the food that we eat. With an intricate fluid system underneath the Earth's skin connects us all like the blood in our veins connects our organs. But just like we all have a responsibility to look after our own bodies, we must look after our world, not just outwardly, but on the inside as well. This is one of the many things that geoenvironmental engineering looks at. How the waste we create in our Earth affects us and how we can build structures to safely contain this waste within our world for many years to come. Cardiff University's Geoenvironmental Research Centre is at the forefront of this research and has pioneered many advances such as the world-leading programme COMPASS that can predict how dangerous pollutants will flow through our Earth and ultimately the solutions needed to safely contain this waste within our planet. We are not only looking at ways that we can protect our fluid living Earth from the toxic waste we put into it, but our geo-environmental engineering work is discovering new ways to use our planet's natural flowing system deep in the ground to help us meet our population's future energy needs. CERN is a groundbreaking research project that is helping to identify ways in which the Earth's natural resources can generate clean, environmentally sound, sustainable energy. Where the processes beneath our Earth's fragile skin may be one part of the puzzle in providing for our future energy needs. We are not only looking at ways to protect our world against the waste from our energy needs, but we are also looking at how our beautiful planet itself may be one part in the solution to create green, sustainable energy, not only now, but for generations and generations to come. <laughs>